Hello and welcome to this video where I'm going to show you how to create a Windows 2016 VM in Azure to run Docker using Azure CLI. So if you want to get up and running quickly using 2016 and Docker, Microsoft supply images in Azure with Docker pre-installed. So these are quite handy. They update the images from time to time. So the first step is to actually find the image you want to use. So we use a bit of PowerShell for that. So I'm going to run a command called get Azure RM VM image. You'll see the publisher name is Microsoft Windows Server, and we're looking for 2016 data center with containers. So I'm going to choose the latest release, which is at the bottom of the list, uh, which is the 2018-06-13. So I'll move across to the Azure CLI script. I've opened a session in Cloud Shell. So this script, we're essentially just going to create a basic VM which will take all the defaults. It will automatically create a public IP. I'm going to stick it in the resource group called SNP. You'll see where it says image. Uh, that's the image that I selected in when I showed you how to find your image. And the size, I'm taking a standard B1MS, which is one vCPU and two gig of RAM. So let's just run this now. And there you'll see it's running. So that's it creating the VM at the moment. So now we have a VM created. And you'll see we've now got a public IP address that we can connect to to log on to the VM and check the status of Docker. So we'll connect using the username Docker user. So in PowerShell, we'll just run the command Docker version. And there you can see we're running Docker version 17.06. Thank you for watching this video.